One thing that I've noticed, and you've probably seen it on your installs, is uh, a lot of stations now are going to the model of uh, big board, little board. You know, where where they have their Dimension One or D32 or, you know, a right. larger board that's their main production control room board. But then they want this little board over here. And that little board is either going to be an emergency control room or it's going to be uh, available for production work, you know, uh, apart from the main PCR board. I've even seen some installations where that smaller board would be for automation purposes. Right, right, yeah. Well, big, but in the big board, little board scenario, little board has to be able to grab all the sources that the big board has. Sure. And that's uh, the network allows you to do that. You yeah, know, that for maintenance purposes. Um, yeah. Areas where you want to have simultaneous operations. And some, there's a lot of stations that are doing multiple, uh, feeding multiple networks as well. So it's not a station in the old days used to be, if you're an ABC or NBC, that's what you were. And today you drive up, you see, you may see three logos. In fact, I've been to a station that was, I think ABC, NBC, and it might've been CBS but I, or, or Fox. I forget exactly yeah. what the combo was, but I was like, wow, they're, it's like, they're almost, how can they do this and compete against themselves almost in markets? But they were generating multiple newscasts right in the same facility to have different sets yeah, and it's, you know, you, you especially see that with Fox stations because the Fox program network programming schedule ends at 10. Right. And that's when their news starts, which is yeah. a full hour ahead of when the other networks uh, end their network programming and, and kick it back to the, to the local affiliates. Actually, we just sold a D8 system to uh, a station up in Ohio, and they actually do four networks okay. out of this one. And it's all the four majors, ABC, NBC, CBS, and Fox. Well, it plays back to what radio did um, back at the, I guess it would have been in the early 2000s, right? When we were very heavy into consolidation, where they were taking all the brick and mortar plants for the different stations and consolidating, you know, buying up stations and consolidating right. under one roof. That's when the networking of audio, and at that point TDM, was really big. It was a really good idea because it would... It would help them, um, you know, meet that goal of tying everybody together under one roof, having one system that essentially tied audio sources and loud sharing and distribution to a central equipment room from various production and control rooms. So that's yeah. so that kind of played into that. And now we're now you're seeing that in TV to some extent, where the same things happening. I think it was Sinclair recently purchased uh, is on a big buying spree, from what I understand. Oh, they're growing like a weed. Yeah. So, and they're not just smaller market stations as. No, no. Yeah, it's all over the place. Right.